G'day collectors, Sci-Fi back again with another action figure review from the 6 inch line on the 25th anniversary of episode 1. This beauty, Darth Maul and the Sith Speeder. This is the box that it came in, it's very good, pretty big. Yeah. Deadly Agile Sith Lord, Sith, Sinister Darth Maul's formidable warrior. Da -da 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 -da. I can read all that. If you wish, the Sith Speeder does not use weapons, shields or sensors. Instead, it achieves hawk-like speed and incredible maneuverability. There you go, that's pretty cool. So it looks like on the box from the movie. I'll show how we have a look at everything, so, shall we? I'll keep it to the it here for a bit. I like the background. Now, I do remember <coughs> seeing, I think it was a 12-inch version, many, many years ago. Wow. Yeah, my ex-wife didn't let me buy that, you know. But I'm one with divorce, and divorce is one with me. Anyway, Darth Maul himself, the big bad. How cool is that? Wow, that is well done. I, I do have a Darth Maul. I think probably the first Black Series one. I'm pretty sure this is an improvement. Um, I believe all the cloth, the clothing was not fabric; it was plastic. But that looks amazing, and I think you've got more than just one coat, cloak on as well. Yep, you do. Got a secondary, which he does wear. I think it's just black on black on black, isn't it? Wow, look at that, look at the detail on his boots. That's mad. That is really good. Very well made fabric too. And it's not so, it's not very flare. I'm funny feeling the arms might flare up a little bit. But that's okay. It's quite, I'm not going to pull it all to bits. I don't know. Now let's see how this cloak fits on his head. Will that, will that billow out? Oh no, that is good. Way better. At last we'll reveal ourselves to the Jedi. At last we'll have revenge. Yeah. How oh, cool. Very, very impressed. That is great. Okay, and also comes with a few. Stands quite well. Fantastic. Comes with his electro binoculars. Awesome. One handed or two handed. It's up to you. So, look through that side. I forget which side you look through. I'll have to watch The Phantom Menace again. Oh, again, yeah. All right, and here we go. It's his lightsaber. Oh, the twin lightsabers. Or in, in the first part of the movie when he pulls out his lightsaber. One blade. But of course, if you want to, go for the two blade. His hands look pretty good there. They grip it quite well. I don't know if they'd actually grip these binoculars, though. No, hands look a bit, a bit big. Oh. Yeah, that'd be all right. That'd be all right. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay, I'll have to park that away. There is a holster bit on it. Where on the figure would that go? Probably on his belt somewhere. I don't know. <clears throat> Probably around the back. Doesn't he pull it out from behind him? I can't remember again. It's been a while since I watched it. Actually, no, I watched it this year. Huh. Alright, so there's all the bits and pieces. There's that, there's that. And then, of course, his probe droid. That is pretty darn good. I never had this in the six inch for the in the six inch line. Definitely had it in the three, three quarter inch. Same with Maul and the speeder. And the saber. This is great. Wow, that's very well made. No other extra colouring on it. This is black on black on black. Not a problem. Uh, I also noticed another thing with Darth Maul here. He doesn't have his earring. No earring. It's very noticeable in the film. Gold. Hoop. Sort of thing. And here we are. The Sith Speeder. That's cool. And it comes with a repulsor lift type stand. Stand. Pity about the CE plastic emblem on it. That's all right. And there we go. Peg holes or pegs. Excellent. Not bad. I'm going to get a close. Yeah, that looks good. Wow. Is that a sticker? Or oh, I don't know. I'm not going to find it. I'm not going to peel it back. I think it is. Hmm. Now, uh, the seat looks pretty good. Worn looking thing. Yeah, the scuff marks on it and everything looks good, but 
could be dirtier. We'll have a look on the back here. That's a colour difference in this. Yeah, I don't know. And there's that green, green lights there. That was exhaust engine. It's not bad though. It's very well made. That's cool. Yep, as you can see the that bit there and there. Cool. Just the colouring's a bit off, but that's okay. Not bad at all. Wow. So what I heard it the other day. Someone else called this thing another thing: a dark fin, a blood fin. I don't know. That's bizarre. All right, let's get him on the bike and see how easy it is. I'll do it off camera. All right, there we go. It fits on. Does sits on there quite nicely. He was sitting on it in the box and was covered and wrapped up in millions of these bloody things. Took me a while to cut them off. Don't, uh, once you get yeah, the pegs, pegs uh, don't fit with the peg holes quite well. You put one in and one pops off. Vicious circle. Hands do well. These handlebars, they move around. They're manoeuvrable quite well. It's not too bad. Send his head forward a bit. I'm trying to get his bum right in the seat too. Uh, so he's not like hovering, but he doesn't want to do it too well. But it's not bad. <clears throat> not bad at all. Glad I picked him up. Another one for the prequel shelf. Happy to have him. Yeah. I wonder how much the, the toes 12 inch ones go for these days. I don't know. Yeah, I remember in the video game Star Wars Demolitions. <laughs> The saber goes like that, through it, through here and here. So I those little holes and that's when he's flying around and... Or you can fly him around and just slice and dice. Not a problem. Okay, alright. Quite impressed. To take a photo as well. I'll take that cardboard bit out and take another photo. Alright, that looks pretty darn good. Alright, a couple more videos coming up soon. Uh, um, yeah, can't wait to get them. All these pre-orders, they're coming out thick and fast now in the months of September, October, November. Yeah. All right, guys, what do you guys think? I like it. Okay. All right, that's my video for today. We'll catch up again shortly. All righty. Sci-fi out, and the force is with you, always.